in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we need you right now. Like never before. God, somebody needs you to make a way out of no way. God, somebody needs you to touch their life right now. Somebody is right at the brink about to give up. But they heard that song in the spirit that says, I just can't give up now. Because I've come too far from where I started from. Nobody told me the road would be easy, but I don't believe he's brought me this far to leave me. God, we need you right now like never before. God, there's an urgency right now, God, that we need you to be in this place right now. Father, we need you to have your way in the name of Jesus. And devil, you are defeated. I decree and I declare that you are defeated right now. That you will take your hands off of ministries. That you will take your hands off of families. That you will take your hands off of finances. That you will take your hands off of health right now in the name of Jesus. God, I need you to do it right now. God, we're standing here touching and agreeing. And God, we're asking for you to come right now. For we need you, Lord. We can't do it by ourselves because if we did, we wouldn't need you. But God, we need you to make a way out of no way. God, we need you to pick us up. We need you to wipe the tears from our eyes. We need you, God, to bless us like never before. And God, I reverse the curse of the enemy right now. And I pray that deliverance will flow throughout this house in the name of Jesus. God, let your spirit come in this place. God, do it now. Oh, come on, people of God. If you need them, just cry out to them right now. Just begin to ask them, God, I need you. God, I need you. I need you right now, Lord Jesus. Oh, I need you to come in right now, God, and make a way out of the way. Come on, say right now, Jesus, right now, right now. God, I can't wait for tomorrow. I need you to do it immediately. All power belongs to you, God. Do it in the name of Jesus. Have your way in this house, God. And shave your hand or say amen or say some type of sign that I'm talking about you. Uh, Psalms the 69 chapter, the psalmist said, Save me, O God, for the flood waters are up to my neck. Deeper and deeper I sink into the mire. I can't find a foothold. I am in deep water. I know y'all being quiet. I know some folk in here that just feel like you sinking deeper and deeper and the floods overwhelm me I am exhausted from crying for help is there anybody uh, in here that been exhausted from crying I, 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 I'm glad I have some folk that have cried out to God you exhausted you're tired in your body because you've been crying for help saying Lord when will you come and answer my cry it says my throat is parched my eyes are swollen with weeping, waiting for my God to help me. Anybody ever been there? Those who hate me, hate me without cause. They outnumber the hairs that are on my head. Anybody in here got haters in here that they hate you and you don't even know why they hate you. You ain't done nothing to them. You ain't said nothing to them. You ain't been in a house. You ain't been around them. They just don't like you because they know that See, there's because God I on the like inside of you. Tonight. That's because whenever you I go through to hell in my destiny. life, I got to preach the hell and praise the hell out of my situation because I'm so tired of what the enemy is does. And when the enemy turns up his attacks, all I do is turn up my praise. Is there anybody in here that have made up in your mind that you're going to turn up your praise in the name of Jesus. Luke, the 21st chapter. This is why I'm going I'm to leave you with this one. Luke 21 and 28. And it says, so when all these things begin to happen, stand 
and look up for your salvation is near. Uh, let's see, if, if I had some folk in here that really knew what it was like to go through, you'd be shouting on that point. Because the Bible tells us to stand and look up because salvation is near. Maybe you don't know what stand me. Y'all remember when the Israelites back in the Old Testament, when they were going against the Amalekites, the Bible says, stand still and see the salvation of the Lord. For the enemies that you see today, you will see tomorrow no more forever. In other words, what do I do when I go through all of this hell, when I got all these haters, when I got all these problems? What do I do when I don't have my bills paid? What do I do when I don't have to be able to find my way out? What do I do when I don't have the car that I need or the house that I'm in? Come on. What do I do when everybody's stabbing me in the back and smiling in my face? The Bible says stand and look up. I wonder if I got anybody in the house that'll be able to stand and look up. Is there anybody in here that understands that the enemy wants to stop you from looking up? But I heard somebody say that if you can look up, then you can get up. Is there anybody here that have made up in your mind? Devil, you can send whatever you want to send, but I'm going to keep on standing. Devil, you can come my way, but I'm going to keep on standing. I made up in my mind that I'm moving Moving forward, I feel like pizza now. I made up in my mind that you can say whatever you want, but I serve a God that's able to do exceedingly abundantly. I serve a God that'll take my haters and shut their mouths. I serve a God that'll take every storm and turn it into a sunny day. I serve a God. That'll take every child and turn it into a testimony. Is there anybody here that knows that you serve a God that's able? Has anybody tried them? Oh, I'm preaching better than you shout. Has anybody tried them? Has anybody been down to nothing? But then God was up to something. Has anybody ever tried Jesus? He's all right. Have you tried him today? I wonder if you have tried him. I've come to realize that the devil can't stop me. Sit what you want. But the more the devil comes, the more I ball up my sleeves and say, let's go devil. For it is written that man shall not live or bread alone by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of God. Some of y'all need to fight the enemy with the word. Say, devil, it is written that I am the head and not the tail. I'm above and not believe. I'm the lender and not the bower. Yeah, I look broke now, but the Bible tells me that I'm blessing the city, blessing the field, bless when I come, bless when I go.